Hi there everybody, Charlie Houck, another episode of Fast Tip Friday. Hey, this one, uh, I gotta work to kinda keep this short because I could go down a rabbit hole on this one. So um, I'm gonna try to hit the high points, throw it out there at you, let you digest it, go apply it to your business development practice uh, as best you can. If you need help, hey, maybe you wanna give me a call and talk to me about it. Um, here's what I'd like to tell you. Feature and benefit selling ain't gonna make you money. Now, I'm not saying it hasn't made you money. I'm not saying it doesn't work, but I am saying this. It's not efficient. It's not effective. It's not the best way to get the results that you're after. And I don't care what the engineering and the research and development and the marketing departments tell you about it. Facts and figures and data do not create business development success. What you really need to do is to understand what the emotional component is that drives a prospect to make a decision to work with you. And so one of the examples that I like to use is when um, you think of a tow truck service and you think of why you need a tow truck service. Well, none of us wake up every day and have a tow truck budget for when we're gonna be on the side of the road with a flat tire, a bad carburetor, an ignition switch that won't turn on or whatever it is, a dead battery. And we, we're looking for a tow truck service and we have an idea of what we'll pay for it. Well, I really think there's so much more that determines the value of that tow truck beyond the open 24 hours, three trucks, respond in an hour, uh, no damage to your bumper or whatever the features and benefits are of that service. What matters most is the emotion of what your circumstance is. So what are you willing to pay for a tow truck? Well, frankly, it could be anything depending upon where you are, where you have to be, when you have to be there, what the climate is. Is it raining? Is it snowing? Is it icy? Are you in the middle of nowhere? Do you need to get somebody to the hospital? Are you up against it and you'll pay whatever it takes to get out of the predicament that you're in? So it's not the features and benefits that really drives the value for that tow truck operator. It's the circumstance in which they provide you the service of getting you from where you are to where you need to be. All the features and benefits in the world are not gonna create the same value as the emotional state of worry, frustration, fear, anxiety, nervous, uh, upset, ticked off. Those are the words that drive urgency and create high value transactions in business development. So yes, you gotta know about your product. You gotta know why your service is what it is but you've really got to understand and get into the information about why someone wants it, why they want it now, and what happens if they can't get it for you to get the real value of your offering. So to all you sales engineers out there, to all you research and development people, for all you people that are making things bigger, better, faster, brighter, whiter, cleaner, I love what you do but you've got to understand it from the buying perspective, not the selling perspective. Those of you in the business development arena, it's not what you know, but what you don't know that creates the best opportunity and the most urgency for you to collect a decision that's best for you and the prospect. So features and benefits are nice, but you've got to know what makes them valuable to the customer before they have any value at all. Change your thinking, change your results, change your income. Thanks for listening. Have a great day, a great weekend. Go have a great week next week.